So, you're a developer in Roblox Studio, and you might, most professional developers, if you're, you're, you're like a good developer, you don't use free models, you probably just don't use free models, but um, still, I think people should be aware, because one time it actually got inserted into a part, this script that I did not, no one added, but it just got randomly added, apparently by Roblox Studio. But this video explains, if you're a starter developer, or just any developer, why you should not use a free model from any random person. These things here, with the, like, whatever these yellow badge things are, I think these are pretty safe. So, the, uh, these things, though, these random things right here, um, these are, could be problems. And if we make it bigger, let's search up, like, um, chair or something. So we're going to search that up, and you'll see lots of, wow, these, these are really cool chairs, guys. I'm going to put this in my game. So we insert the chair. Let's look in, into things here. Let's see if we can find any scripts that might have a problem. Look at this, guys. As you can see here, you just found a script. And the script in the, uh, so if you have a free model, look in every part and see if there's a script in it. Let's see what the script does. Well, it, look, 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 look. I don't know, you see, it's like a Game Pass idea, I think. So, let's check it out. Um, I don't know what the script is. Um, slash, I think, slash Game Pass, slash, paste that in there. Alright, so that got a 404. Um, I don't know if that... If we gotta just see a real I don't even know if that's the right game pass link so let's just head into bubblegum sim go to one of the game passes and see here so we click on it and oh yeah I knew I knew there was a dash alright then we just paste the link in there and let's see what this does it see it got banned it see guys this is what we're talking about here if you see this any script in here in a in a theme that you really don't need, delete it. Because this ID is literally banned, and I don't, and it's banned. So it's because this is a hack script. It it's, can, it could really ruin your game. And if you play, the, these usually make it so you teleport to a random game. And also the script is just really made wrong. I mean, look. I mean, the equal sign is connected. Just delete it. And then you'll see that a script might appear later on and it'll be called like welding or debounce that means that's another scary script and we're just gonna try to find it there so search a beach and this is how I find it like I use free models like a noob and so this is what I used so what you're gonna do is you're going to head into it of course and head into each let's see we got the meshes here no scripts yet I thought I think these were pretty safe to begin with, but over time there are scripts that become added to the game, and these are right here. Just a look through each one, and then the pillow is our next part because you never know when these thing when these scripts can just randomly appear. It seems pretty safe. We didn't look through here yet, but I mean let's see this. This is the umbrella and a mesh though. So, I mean this seems pretty safe but I did get a virus script from this so let's just find something else. Um, sandcastle. Let's look inside. Vi I mean right here! We have a virus literally in this thing. It says virus. This is like clearly virus. This is a virus guys. You need the more and more and more games are getting done every day because of these viruses. Look inside the model every time you insert one, anything here, anything suspicious, delete it. Look it, there's viruses everywhere. Virus. Everywhere. Just delete all of this stuff. Besides the mesh, because the mesh is what builds it. Uh, just delete everything. See guys, that is what we're talking about here. Viruses in the game everywhere. Now look, this is perfectly safe, but but no, it's it's still not because over time those scripts might be added back into the model, like they were with some of my free models that I stupidly used in my game. Just 
it's, it, look guys, you have to look. If you're a noob scripter developer, please watch the video, because this goes for everyone. Look at, okay, snap, just a couple of welds in here, this seems to be safe. You still, delete the welds, I mean, you really don't need them. Just delete all the welds. And over time, welds will just come back into the part. But those, that was scary. When we saw that virus there, that was just a complete virus. So, let's see, this has, I don't even, don't even check for all that stuff. That's a really laggy model, and that will lag your game. You can just tell. So this thing is a part, and it's a morpher. Now let's see the script. I believe this is the script for... Yep, this is just a normal script. I think that just don't don't use none of these morphers. Most most people starting and develop scripting, they um just use these morph morph things. So just delete it. Let's see, beach seats. You can just gotta look through every single one. See what is this part here for? Don't a mesh. Gee, I mean, just look at all this. Really, you don't need a lot of those parts. I mean, that's why free models are a problem. And I think if you're starting game, just please check these things out. And if we look up beach ball, oh, see, perfect. There's even nothing in this thing, so just use it. Still, I do not recommend using free models. It with these beaches, it's not hard to place two parts and just color and texture them to look like a beach. I mean, it's not hard. So let's see. We have a beach set. I don't know, I'm just wasting time trying to find viruses in these things. Uh, let's see, I'm too lazy to look through it. But if you really want in your game, be sure to just look through it. See, there's still some, like, the same repeats coming on again. They're just copies and things. So, look up virus. What happens? Extreme virus script. Oh, wow. Game destroyer. What the heck? Spread. <laughs> This is the virus pet in Bubblegum Sim. Now let's actually see if it gives the virus. See. What? Alright, just delete this. this is it, it's not necessary. I mean, see, your pet still comes in a perfect thing. Now what's this value here? What's this stream value? Okay, fly. I don't know. Just don't, don't steal pets like that. It's not okay. In my old videos, I stole, like, emotes for this tutorial and people were like why are you stealing emotes and I'm like I don't know I was just a noob at the time all I used was free models back then now we're now we're professional by the way this is in our pet hatching system game so be sure to actually play it we have new pets in the eggs um, I don't know when the update will be out but it will sometime Alvin blocks is kind of kind of banking on and on him so if he makes a data store they should come out and if it works and stuff Okay, so, what was I going to do? Okay, yeah, so, anytime you randomly teleport to a place, look up weld. This is first step. Oh, perfect, guys. We just found the script. Alright, so, this is kind of the main video. I might post a timestamp on the pinned comment to kind of explain the part here. Now, you'll see that this is, I don't know, I really, I, if someone can comment down below explaining what this is, because this is a problem right here. This, this, these are problem scripts. All right, so let's um, analyze this. Now, be sure to kind of sit up in your chair if you're watching this, because you can't really see it. You can't really see this. But if you do, let's read. This is a script from Roblox Studio. Please do not delete it, as it could, as it is crucial in order for your game to work properly. <laughs> Thank you. Well, no. It, it's not crucial at all because you delete it, everything works fine, and it's you're not going to be teleported to random places. Um, this these are random numbers. I mean, I don't know what they mean or anything. Um, but please, this is there's no reason for this. Now these actually randomly enter your game. They randomly enter, and it's weird because they just randomly enter. You can't really do nothing because I guess every day you need to check your game to see. And then if you do this, just search weld or debounce. And that's usually where you find them. So welding, um, this is in the egg, which is some, I think in this, in my studio I have this game. Now this G dominus has the same exact thing. Look, oh, come on. Delete it. This same thing every single time, guys. 
It's just a bunch of garbage scripts. And even in like nor these aren't even in free models. These are not in even in free models. This is anything. That's uh, why it does my sound have welding in it. That makes no sense. It doesn't need welding a sound. These are just weld constraints. Um, I don't really need these normal welds, so I'm just deleting them. These don't really do anything. Let's search debounce, and you'll see that we still have scripts. What does the debounce need from a multiplier? What does the studio need for a debounce? Um, what the heck? And then I think if you just search script, you will see even some more. And oh yeah, fix is another one. Fix is another one. Come, I not I don't care if I'm editing it. If I'm deleting it, then I want to. So every just script here, you gotta delete. So let's search fix. So that's where it's coming. We just deleted all the fixes. No, I don't. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Good. No, I don't like a studio like this. Okay, we we gotta fix that. I don't like it. No, come on. No, I don't like studio like that. I'm not, I'm a noob at trying to fi fix this. No, come on. I think we just exit out. We X out of properties. Properties. No. Okay, now let's just put properties back on the bottom at least. I don't. Oh, I just, oh, oh, there we go. Sorry about that. But all right, so let's see here. We got. Let's look through the normal scripts. We have command. This is studio stuff, and this is this is a mistake script that was bad. And okay, so. Since we deleted all those crucial scripts, we let's see what happens once we play the game. Yeah, every every hour just check for them actually because they are that because one one of them did teleport me to a random place in Object Sim, and if you might play Object Sim, you might well, you you might notice that you actually get teleported to a different game that loads it technically, and that's what those scripts are. Um, I think Roblox needs to do something about this. These are not crucial. I mean, like, everything is working fine. What is crucial? Still collecting objects. Everything's fine. We hatch an egg, and we hatch a Dominus. I mean, we can still equip it, and everything's fine like this. And so, yeah, there's lots of scripts heading into these games that are definitely problems. So be sure to check your game, search fix, welding, and debounce, and you will find some guarantee, not, just not guarantee. I don't know what this, any of this, it's an object sim, we hatched a neon wolf, okay, not bad, hatched this legendary pet. So yeah guys, we got lots of things coming in. I, I am sorry for that noise in the background. Fortunately, my sister can't tell that I'm recording, and that's disappointing. But alright guys, so like and subscribe if you want more. I mean, uh, just be sure to check guys, all developers, watch this.